Hey yo, how's it going everybody and welcome back to another Team Aldo Cook-Off. Now today guys, I had to get the three healthiest guys in the crew. We're doing salads today. The first contestant, if he's not at the hills, he might be in our basement doing bench, off in his best friend Jacob's basement doing his little... We got David Perry. He's doing push-ups. Oh, just the 200 only. What's good, guys? Not the day back to win my third cook off in a row. Here we go. Oh, Salad yank. Up next, if he's not doing yoga, if he's not in our gym, he's off getting acai bowls. The man, the myth, the legend. It's your healthy, it's your boy. It's your D's, baby. Dave, come here right now. Comment down below who's more D's. And thirdly, he's in our gym doing two a days. He worked out twice yesterday, all right? Ryan. Swayze, baby, Swayze. Cut <laughs> online sharper than a nice baby. Swayze, baby, in the building tonight. Salmon Swayze. Who do you think has eaten the most salads out of you three? Me, 100%. Swayze? Uh, I think I've eaten a lot of salads. But guys, it's not about who's eaten the most salads, it's about who can make the best salad today. Let's not waste any time. Let's introduce our ingredients. Up first, we have the green leaf lettuce. We got red leaf lettuce, and we got romaine lettuce. We got baby spinach in the cut, if you want to have a little healthy vibe. We got some carrot shavings, you know, get those little colors in there. We got grape tomatoes. We got lemons as well for a little garnish. Cucumbers, both peppers. We got avocado. And as well, we have Caesar dressing. We have balsamic vinaigrettes, but also the ingredients to make your own salad dressing if you dare but as well we have a protein for your salads these guys have a choice between steak Fats. chicken Fats. and shrimp all right i'll do shrimp johnny last johnny second <laughs> so i go first i'll take the steak Shout out Tender Greens. So Sean is up first. These guys are gonna be around roasting Sean if he messes up anything like that. Now is where I need you guys at home. Please provide me your, your brain, your smarts. Yeah. Comment down below the next food cook off. If you've seen every episode, we've done like pretty much every food. Salad is one of the last ones I, I go up with. And as well, if you wanna see another Team Apple cook off, like within the next two or three videos of mine, if you wanna see it ASAP back, let's smash 20,000 thumbs up. Ooh. Let's do it at home. Y'all can do it. I get so many comments saying you love the cook-off, so if you do, slide smash idea. thumbs up button. It slides into yours. <laughs> All right, Sean is up first. Let's begin, baby. First things first, you gotta season your steak. I'm white, so of course all I put is salt and pepper. <laughs> so we don't wanna overpower our steak because then it'll, it'll clash, Jad's H, with our salad. Fun know. fact about David Parody. I'm David, allergic. He's allergic to steak. I don't know what that means. So thank God Sean picked that because I have no idea. I've never touched oh, that. It's Ryan in the litter. You respect your cooks, he's, right? Yes. You respect your cooks. You don't no, like, invade it. their I'm personal not, space. Not, not, not. <laughs> this guy's. <laughs> <laughs> I was salting a little too much. Oh! I also want to know who's cooked the most out of you three because we don't know. We don't know who, who's cooked the most out of David. I'll give Ryan. He's been a jackass the most. <laughs> <laughs> want to get a nice little sizzle? Yikes! Wait, wait, wait! wait. <laughs> Holy! Okay, right. so that's there. You can hear the sizzle now. <laughs> most of my salads are very one-dimensional, but. We have a bunch of different types of lettuce, so why not use it? Holy smokes! Oh my. <laughs> yo, yo, yo. <laughs> it can't be another way. I don't know how. Yeah, Dave's laughing. What are you doing? <laughs> let, let's see. Let me see what you do. Okay, so we got a little mix of that. Oh, you Alright, now Sean's going everything. for the green leaf. Yeah. Ooh. I'm mixing them up. Variety is the spice of life, ladies and gentlemen. I can tell by his face he hasn't done it. Zoom it on his face. Like, <laughs> <laughs> There are some big ones, some small ones. Yeah, so variety is the spice of life. Just like Albo, a little bit of everything. Oh! Are Sean deciding what he wants with the steak salad? You know what I know I want? Yaviados. Fresh, yaviados. free shavaka do? This I've done before. Oh, that's okay. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh! How do you want your yaviados to be in oh. the salad? Uh, normally, I like the vibes where it's like cute. We're gonna go with the long slices. Did he burn it? Oh, we're, oh, he's still gonna leave it down, trusting in the product. It's a thick steak. Oh, we're gonna try and get this out nice and smooth. Yo, 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 yo. Contestant, it's your boy, showing some chef techniques. Chef Deej. 
<laughs> All right, so we've got our, our avocados ready. Oh. I don't know if you want to add those just yet. All right, now we're going to add some cucumbers. Thinly sliced. Oh, Sean's going for the circular. This gives you a little crunch. The salad doesn't have too much crunch in it. Chef David, what do you think of Sean so far? It's Sean's salad. I'm not focused. I'm focused on what I'm about. Oh, you're not worrying about other people. I like that. I That's like smart. that. You know, I respect that. We need to add some color. To this salad. This is just green with a little like cucumbers. And we got avocados, both green. So we're gonna add in some little cherry tomato vabs. Two more. Actually, right, I'm gonna eat one. I like that. I like that. The other chefs are judging, you know, judging. I'm gonna add the cucumbers in now too. Okay, geez, yo, this salad actually so far. Looking pretty damn lit. It's not gonna be too complicated, okay? I'm not going for a complicated salad, but I'm going for a solid, enjoyable salad. It's very early in the morning and I'm starving, so I actually wanna make something I enjoy. <laughs> We're gonna go back and check on the steak. I think it's ready, potentially. Oh, that's looking pretty nice. That's folks. nice. Look at that steak. Ready to go? This is gonna sizzle this time. Oh, okay, okay. We're going for a big sizzle. Oh! Yo. You love it, you love it. That's looking good. And a very important aspect of this is the presentation, right? Yes. Now this is the king of salads. You may not know it yet, and you know why? This thing is crown. The king of salads now has his <laughs> crown. So basically you're eating your salad. Oh, this is good. You dip it in. Take a bite of your carrots. Of your carrots. Wow. Genius. Carrot. Guys, David Parody is not putting any of the salad to waste. He's burning full calories. Sean is cooking his steak, getting it ready. You need to get your one sweat. Who said to sweat once? Yes, theory. Shout out to them. How Shout does one sweat bead falls off your body onto the ground? You yeah. did a good job, buddy. You had a good day. All right, folks, you see the steak vibe? <laughs> We're going to take this off. We're going to let it sit for a little bit. Major key in the steak process. We're going to slice it up and put it onto our salad. Swayze used to be a big steak. I girl. used to be. What do you think of the steak, Swayze? What uh, it's like a really good steak, to be honest. Yes, please. How is Sean mixing his um, salad? Um, what, what do you mean mixing? It's already mixed. It's already mixed. Oh, but the seasoning and everything? <laughs> I'm not gonna mix it for Jack. Listen, listen, the only yeah. person tossing Jad's salad is me. <laughs> There's a balsamic vinegar, uh, vinaigrette, maple syrup, lemon dressing that really tastes great, but I'm not gonna use it because that's way too complicated. What I'm gonna do instead is go with the old faithful creamy Caesar. Yeah. Don't ever play yourself. Swayze did have a valid point. I should, I should probably mix it in. So we're gonna do that now. Put a little bit on. You don't want too much. We're trying to stay healthy. Aside from the weird horns coming out, that's an actually a banging looking salad. Where did you put my shrimp? Dave, Dave. Why do you automatically assume it? Where did you put it? Yeah, like, it's in the garden where it belongs. Where did he put it? All right, so while Sean's tossing up his salad, Swayze's on a wild goose chase. You're, you're, you're getting cold. You're looking cold. for his shrimp. David hit his oh, shrimp. No. He's protecting his own food. <laughs> You're dead! You're dead! <laughs> okay guys, Sean's slicing it. Let's take a look inside, folks. This is the thickest part. Oh my oh, beautiful medium nice. steak. That looks well nice. done. Evenly cooked throughout. Getting some salt in the hand. Oh, finishing it off with a little salt sprinkle. I don't know if there's any salt in that, but... Oh, there's David with his chicken. I feed on the chicken breast. Adds flavor. The aviado. Oh. The steak on top of it. Yeah! <laughs> yeah, it's chicken. Guys, the chicken run! But back over here, we have Sean. <laughs> All these bozos are playing. I'm catching dubs. Ooh. Beautifully layering his avocado. Another steak, another W. This is looking a little thick. A little thick. Nothing wrong with it. I love thick. <laughs> Beautiful. Is that it? There you have it? Oh, licking his fingers. Oh. It's confirmation, folks. Confirmation on the lick. Huh? All right, ladies and gentlemen. I present to you the king of salads. Cheese! Oh, served to me to eat. Guys, this looks amazing. Let's try it out. And we are back, folks, in the judge's chair. An amazing place to be. This salad looks amazing. You know what Sweet. else looks amazing, Dad? What? You look amazing, man. The salad's looking even yeah. better right now, Sean. The salad's looking even better. Yo, Dave, by the way, where's your chicken? Stop! Stop! Where's what you, the? Where's your chicken, bro? Oh. While Dave's looking for that, I'll go ahead and try a beautiful beast. I want everything in this bite. Let's try this out. How's that taste, Jado? Mm -hmm. That's nice. 
Get a little mm. Caesar, no, not too much. That's a beautifully cooked steak. It's very light. I need to try the cherry tomatoes. Although, I'm not gonna lie, I was hoping Chef Sean would maybe chop the cherry tomatoes. Yeah. What? what? Thick, bro. Are you, I looked at both contestants. I looked at both contestants and they both did this. Dude, the steak. Perfect. Thank you. Yeah, it does look really good. Let me try a bite. Don't. You're gonna spit it out. That's just a waste of steak. I'm so oh, he's dead. Perfect. Chef, Chef Dave is, is eliminated. All right, it's just you and me. Let's, Let's go. go Straight up, Sean just wanted a salad. He wanted to eat. But I'm not taking away from any of this. This is a top notch salad. Slap Sean, that table, baby. Come try it out. I would destroy this whole thing in a, in a heartbeat. Also, guys, for number ratings, we are going to do the whole number ratings at the end. I want to save who wins for the end and keep it a surprise. But Chef Sean scored extremely well. Very good. I wanted croutons, but then I realized. Croutons are bad for you. This is Ooh. a healthy salad, folks, okay? Okay, guys, Sean is going to polish off his steak salad, but he's enjoying it. You can tell it's amazing because he wouldn't be destroying it like he is otherwise, so. I'm eating all of it. It is very good. Up next, we have the highest salad making person Come in on, this competition. Doggy. Chef Sways, I come to the you, table. Man. What, what is he Yeah, he's got his shrimp, but does he have a family joke? <laughs> 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 oh, yeah. <laughs> that was so anti <laughs> yeah. You already know, guys, I am at a little tiny, tiny disadvantage today because to those who know me, I only like shrimp salads and salmon salads. That's all I know. That's all I know. So all this crunch, I don't even know what to do with half this stuff. But let's get it, man. Let's start, let's start preparing. All right, Chef Swayze Baby. <laughs> Swayze Baby, man. See how I didn't say too much? Sean did an amazing job getting all the leaves, so we're just going to start with that. Chopping oh up the my. leaves. Boom. There you go. Just have a bunch. I want some. Jad wants some. The chopping really doesn't matter. I was trolling him, but and just yeeted it. See, oh. we're, we're almost done. Same with this. <laughs> <laughs> yoy, yoy, yoy. <laughs> nice mix and see. I always see Bongo do this too, guys. So I'm just going by muscle memory. Yo, this guy's <laughs> that. You're making one salad, bro. I think this salad, guy man. forgot Dave is going next, but anyways, <laughs> all right, you're up. So <laughs> Chef's face is going for the record fastest cook off ever done in his life. Look at it. <laughs> Swayze's salad bowl has a little bit, but the amount he chopped. A true chef knows how to cook efficiently. <laughs> no, they don't. We're gonna go back, but it's all about efficiency. Damn, Sean cut his avocado so good, I hit it. Now I have to cut my own. Okay, guys, so now we are gonna cut the avocado just like Sean did. Boom, perfect. Shot. Ryan was trying to steal Chef Sean. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> That's a whole thing. How did you do that? How did you do that? We're using this side right here. <laughs> oh, I want to get into none of that. Sizzle and yala. Oh. Boom, boom. So we're gonna let those cook a little bit medium high, but we're gonna go another extra ingredients. We have some nice garlic here. Adding some flavoring, mm -hmm. then some garlic. I actually um, those cook fast, bro. Fast. Like, you dried them. I dried stop, them. Stop, stop, stop. They're already done. Yoy. Oh, some lemon garlic. Oh, we have some pepper as well. Pepper. Get in there, pepper. Some lemon garlic trim right there. Boom. We're going to let that. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to dice some tomatoes because, Sean, we don't want that thick ass tomatoes. Beautiful. You don't want too much tomatoes, IMO. You don't want too, too, too. Oh, so you're purposely picking these smaller ones as the well. Smaller ones, yeah. Okay. Yo, yo, watch out, watch out. Yo, this guy's shaking up the crib. Oh, yo, 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 yo. They've been out for one minute. They're actually almost done. One thing I'm gonna change from Chef Chef Sean Chef Callahan, he is amazing <laughs> salad, amazing. It was more of a steak with a little salad, side salad. He didn't mix prior too. I just love how much salad is flying onto the table <laughs> as he does this. Exactly, that's why you add more. And guys, Chef David is actually getting a step ahead of the competition and preparing just some lettuce prep. leaves. Oh, time for one of the best parts and major keys of a salad. Oh, Ryan is a huge fan of this. Huge ingredients. fan of avocados. This presentation. Is really new to me, but you don't need too many. This ash, all oh, right. You shake up the <laughs> sweating like a madman. Ryan is very concerned about how the salad is gonna go. As you can tell, he's nervous. Mm -hmm. Oh, that, that helps. Tomatoes help. Tomatoes do. Tomatoes help. add. Said it. Home court advantage. Sean was missing that little crunch, but I do see this at Sweet Greens in LA. Shout out Sweet Greens. Just a little sunflower seeds. Oh. It is still healthy. Oh my goodness. Who's, who's gonna make the best? Oh. 
Oh, he actually dropped. He yo, actually, yo. yo, he actually. Man, pulls in Yeah, that's yo, what I'm talking He actually added. Yo! You stick a crouton Wait. right there and it's saved. You stick Wait. a crouton right there and it's saved. Sabotage, sabotage. Use that as your adhesive. Yes, oh, yes. Yeah. You're saved, you're saved, you're saved, you're saved. Yo, okay, yo. this actually salad is turned up. This salad turned up. I've seen Sway's guys off the scenes chopped up a little lemon as well. Come on, bro. I don't know what he's gonna use that for. Oh my. Oh my god, it's right. Guys. Presentation. At Ryan is going shrimp by shrimp. Oh, come on, ladies and gentlemen. Yo, Sway's, Sway's, Sway's. My guy glowed up. And with the final touch. Voila. And with my home court advantage, Sean also forgot a little, little cheese. Oh, I'm not, I, I am right. I use a little croutons, a little cheese, but you worked hard on your nine to five job. Cheese and that also, David hates. Not good for you. On a Caesar, Parmesan is very classic. Ryan, you went for a Caesar salad. There you go, I present to you a Caesar salad. Holy, the shrimp. We got the lemon with the garnish. We have a bedding of great tomatoes on the outside. Oh my God, Ryan, I'm very excited to try this. Yeah. Guys, I want to use the lemon as Ooh. a light flavor on the side. Mm. I'm gonna lie, that, looks, that looks good, right? Thank you so much. Really does. Thank really you much, does. Chef, Chef Sean. I Feel me, this. Dave's dookie. <laughs> Balsamic man. We have avocado, we have some seeds in here. We're gonna grab a little half tomato. Ooh, -wee. we're gonna grab a little crouton, and we're gonna grab a shrimp. Oh, this is a complete bite. Complete. One of every single ingredient with a bit of lemon on it. Tell me what you're thinking. Mmm. -hmm. What you thinking, Jed? You made this? I made that. I don't think I ever, ever got a dance. Show me the moves. Oh, oh, yeah, oh my. Yes! Let's go! It was hot. It was cold. Oh, it was sour. It was sweet. Seeds were nice. The seeds, nice. That's actually good. That's actually good. Well, let the competition try first. Sean is a fan. Sean of is going for one of everything as well, guys. I'm, I'm not trying to get too full. I would definitely destroy the salad as well. <laughs> That's really good. Thank it's really so good. Much, wow. To be honest, I don't even like cherry tomatoes on my style, but I just got a piece with it. It was actually really good. You, you enjoyed it too, because yeah, the avocado in there. And, oh, Dave's just going for the avocado. Mm. The avocado shrimp and a piece of salad might be the best. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yo, Chef Dave is very about cleanliness. Guys, Chef Dave has not said a word in seven minutes. <laughs> Yeah, it has been. Oh, there's the avocado. <laughs> you gonna use this one? I can just cut the other one. Yeah, you, you. Yo, yeah. chef. Oh, what the? That's what he really wants. That's what he really. That's how he really puts his avocados in there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, first contestant even touching the baby spinach. Oh, I love man. that. I love that. Okay, arigato gozaimasu. Best for last. I'm starting off with a nice little bowl of cold water, the most cold you can get out of your faucet. Put some ice in the water because. Does anyone know what's happening? We are creating a nice little ice bath. So we're gonna let that soak in the ice bath, keep it cold and crispy. Are you saying you don't trust Master Chef Jad? Oh, I trust him. I trust him. <laughs> By the way, Jad. I love the shirt you're wearing today. Thank you very much. Wow, that salad looks really good. Anyways, keep going. Oh my God, he's a just... beautiful chicken breast right here. Yes. Now the number one rule. You know how much salmonella poisoning is on this. Oh my Make God. sure you rinse it real good. The comments are snapping saying, don't actually wash your chicken because now you're spreading the salmonella into the thing. Thank you, now I have to thoroughly clean that out. Die Dave is very conscious about his fast and we just want to Oh my goodness. Yo. Makes me cringe. <laughs> you don't want that. And I know Jad is a very, very picky eater, so. We're gonna move on to the plastic bags. You might be wondering why do I need plastic bags? Well, I'm, I'm very much so we wondering. We are gonna be doing a little chicken marinade. Make sure you double layer the bags. So oh, wow. I'm actually this, aged. Look at all the ingredients I have here. I'm gonna use it all. And uh, Chef Ryan, are you still with me here? <laughs> so we got the one tablespoon right here. Oh my we God, yes. A little bit of garlic. Shout out to Ryan. I did not know the house had garlic, so this really does help my chicken out a lot. We have very, very important ingredient. Wish, what, wish that it's your son. Did you bring that from home? Yes, I did. <laughs> Chef Dave has done something no contestant has ever done before. He's brought in an ingredient from home. All right. Wish Worcestershire. Worcestershire. Next ingredient we are adding is seasoned salt. Very important for chicken. If you don't have seasoned salt in your chicken, I don't know what you're saying. Oh my. When you cook it, it's not going to taste that potent, so don't worry. Okay, okay. I like that. You can never season your raw meat too much, right? Yeah, add a 
the squeeze. And Chef Ryan did a big mistake when he did this lemon. You always gotta put your fingers like this to catch the seeds. Oh. You do like this, and you get just the juice. Wow. And the last ingredient, because we're doing a little Asian twist to this, we oh. got the soy sauce. Not too much because there is. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no! Not worry. Oh, nice mooshing. Okay, let that chicken marinate in there. Make sure it gets everywhere. And we're gonna put this in the fridge, let it rest up for the next 48 hours, and we'll see. You guys. <laughs> yeah, I, think wait. I have one already made oh, two days ago. Incredible. Right you even that. added too much soy sauce like last time. Yeah, <laughs> it's chicken, crazy. Yeah. Now, let's just see how this smells after 48 hours. Yeah, can I smell that? 48 hours of marinating. Smell that Asian zing. Oh my, it smells like one total, like before it was seven ingredients, now it's just one ingredient. So my competitors use oil. I will be switching it up and using butter. For your chicken. For my spinach. Because we are gonna be getting a nice layer of this. The thing about spinach is you can use a lot. It freaking shrinks up like 80 times its size, so don't worry. Oh, this Chef might Dave. might look like a lot, but trust. This really is an Asian salad. And look at that, already. It smells nice, yeah, it's, it's already down cooking size down. It's by like three times already. Holy. Already. Yo, that actually looks like a nice little lit garnish, and uh -huh. it's way more green. Have you noticed that? Yeah. Oh, I hear some footsteps in the distance, my friends. Oh, they're, they're, oh, they're, they're, they're back with you. They're still with you, buddy. They're still with you. Uh, I probably wouldn't eat that for my left dependent. <laughs> we don't have to try this. After you don't have to. Yeah, we you don't have, have to. There you go. <laughs> you look such a nice elf. That's an elf. That's what that is. You know what that elf stands for? Loser! No. Oh! Oh! Chef David's marinade of chicken actually looks amazing. Guys, so David is not addressing any haters today. Please tell me that's not garlic. Not interesting. It's, not it's interesting. garlic. Is the pan on? I think Sean's leftovers might be better than Dave's salad, oh. to be honest. Like, I'd rather eat this than that. Yo, yo. You're putting the lid over. Oh. Get the heat oh to make God. a chicken cook quicker. Oh my God, you that's know, actually very smart. Focus the camera onto this label right here. Yes. Wash before use. Come over here and give it a nice that chicken is now sizzling up. Oh, and Look the sides that. are getting so cooked. Mangy. Make sure it takes that sauce. Oh my on the god, side. that smells amazing, by the way. Chef Dave, it's a lot less saucy on this yep. pan. The sauce got reduced and it evaporated into <laughs> the sky. And this is when you add just a teaspoon of barbecue sauce because if you did that before, it would have burnt off. Oh, now it's just a glaze. Now, at the end of the day, what I'm trying to do my salad is to reach umami. Guys, Dave will be at Tokyo 2020, just for those wondering. Oh my goodness, let me look at that chicken. Look at that. Oh my. I could see the grains, mm -hmm. the half waypoints, guys. Definitely got the best quality chicken. You Organic always gotta chicken. taste it before giving it to Chef Jad, so. Are you happy with that chicken? So juicy. Oh my Tender. god. Tender. Now, oh. we are not using a knife to chop it. We are grabbing our lettuce and we are simply Oh, Just breaking it up. Bigger than Way the bigger than, than the. My competitors. Now this is the thing I see. Um, what is this? The top layer of your cook-off bongo, Chef Bongo. Yes. He almost risks a finger loss every <laughs> single time I watch the videos. <laughs> Always cut with your knuckles. This is where the bakuru comes into play. Oh. Me personally, I would make a nice guac, put it over the chicken. I'm just gonna go with a nice little diced. But we're also gonna go the other side too to make a little bit of square. Chef Dave showing off some confidence with the knife. Okay, so we got some nice diced. Yes, cubed, beautifully cubed. Avocados. And we're gonna add the chicken on now. As you can see, the chicken is flying off of the plate, creating an umami flavor salad. We're just gonna add that around here as a little boner. Ah, <laughs> border! So we have a nice border. Oh, beautifully make done. Make sure the chicken is every on every bite. We're gonna add our diced avocado right over oh top. Oh my god, amazing. As you can see, you might think I'm done. I'm just getting started. We're now gonna put this in the fridge and let it refrigerate for 48 hours. And we'll be back. Good thing I have one already. Oh my, yo! Wow. This is how you chop a pepper quick. Oh. <laughs> Do you like pepper, Chef Jeff? I love pepper, Thank Chef God. Chef Dave. Time to add the Parmesan cheese, ladies and gentlemen. We're coming home to the home stretch right now. And last but not least, we got our lemon. Oh. We gotta get the juices flowing. Oh. That's it. Guys at home, please so, don't use a knife that way. A little drizzle. Oh, I see it. Nice little cracked black pepper. Oh. And there you go. You're done? No dressing is needed, sir. No dressing is needed. Okay, so the <laughs> final step, we might use a little bit of balsamic vinegar. Oh, 
man. He's beautiful. I think yo, yo, yo. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is the umami salad, salad courtesy of David Parody. Of we Chef Parody. This looks like I went to a one star reviewed restaurant. Okay. Ordered General Tao chicken. Mm -hmm. They gave me this. No, I'm pissed. I'm all about being weird, ladies and gentlemen. Piece of chicken? Oh, yeah. I'm telling you, you don't need dressing in my salad. Piece of spinach? Oh, yeah, I need the spinach. <laughs> that balsamic was forced. Oh, my God. <laughs> He's being aggressive like I was aggressive, too. I like it. You are what you eat. <laughs> okay, this is one of everything in this bite. Please enjoy and watch Jad's face oh, enter umami. The lettuce is cold, which is beautiful because the chicken is a little bit hot. So that hot cold, the avocado is very flavored. You taste lemon, right? It's a lot of lemon and the pepper. The juiciness from the tomato, this is very well balanced. That balance we're looking for in a salad, it's there. The baby spinach, you try the chicken? Chicken's not bad. The chicken is really good. Yo, here's the thing, the chicken is perfectly cooked. You know when chicken is like too hard and like rubbery or something like that? It's not like that. Mm -hmm. You bite it and it's just, you know what you want. Okay. <laughs> Nothing moved when you poked into it. It's good though. It is good. And you can, you know what? This might be the healthiest salad of them all. It's not bad. It's surprising. Mm. It's good. It's really good. <laughs> all the salads have been eaten, my friends. All the salads have been judged. Let's figure out who our winner is. Let's just give these guys a round of applause at home. Please. That was amazing chefing. Amazing. Ladies and gentlemen, there you have it. That was the salad cook off. There could only be one winner of today's challenge but i will give one thing first every single salad scored overall above 8.5 out of 10. first shout out i want to give to all right subscribe to his channel it was amazing i'm gonna give it an 8.5 out of 10. i feel like he could have went for 10 if he was making a salad to be judged by others but he was just very hungry and wanted to eat himself so sean congratulations 8.5 overall Still amazing, the steak was amazing. I'm giving this score a nine out of 10. Guys, it was amazing, a lot of love, a lot of time was put into it. Chef Parody, which means the winner of his first cook-off out of maybe first nine cook-offs. Oh. in the walls, Chef Slay. Baby, all I need is salad, toss that salad, baby. Ryan, I gave you a 9.2 out of 10, it was an amazing salad. It was Thank really good. Thank you so much. And stuff that he wouldn't own. Yes! yes! I want you to 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 I do have to say something. This will be my last cook up. <laughs> I only was on this a perfect win streak, now I have lost, so I will be retiring. What if they smash those up button? Will you say it, please? For one more fine, later? Fine, fine. If yeah, this fine. video gets 10,000 likes, I will say. Please, please, please do it, guys. Just smash those up button right now. So this was an amazing episode. Like I said, we have the three healthiest, the three most fit, the three most athletic. Comment down below the next cook up we should do. Just do it. Comment right now. I want 10,000 comments, and we'll, be, we'll all reply to the comments. Every single one, so comment down below. Right now. That's it for me. Thank you so much for watching this amazing salad cook-off. Have the best day, not just the average day, really, really have the best day of your lives. And we'll see you in, in the next video. Peace!